So when I was in Brazil quite recently, I went to a traditional Brazilian barbecue that my friend was having and I got introduced to the Brazilian Alexander. Now, the Brazilian Alexander is not a person, it's a drink. A very alcoholic drink that doesn't taste alcoholic, it just tastes delicious. So today I'm going to show you how to make a Brazilian Alexander. The Alexander as a cocktail drink was quite popular in I think it was the early 20th century, so that would make it the early 1900s. And the recipe for that was just equal proportions of uh, brandy, cream, and creme de cacao. So in Brazil, they seem to have their own little recipe and it involves condensed milk. So I'm going to show you the secret recipe for Brazilian Alexander that my friend husband my friend's husband shared with me so I'm gonna make it today hopefully it's gonna come out just as delicious I have cognac instead of brandy I think that'll work and I don't have creme de cacao I'm gonna throw in a little bit of Kahlua and I've got some chocolate Baileys and we'll see what it tastes like um, hopefully it'll be just as delicious as what I encountered in Brazil. So of course you're going to need a blender. I've got some nutmeg. You put a little bit of nutmeg on the top afterwards. I've got some condensed milk, Kahlua. I've got that. I think I'm going to do like half Kahlua, half um, the chocolate. This is the cognac I've got and the cream. And I'm going to add in, I'm going to use the condensed milk can as my measuring um, container. And um, so I'll pour the condensed milk in and then I will add in these other ingredients. Okay, I've put in the condensed milk, the cream, the brandy and the... Kahlua and chocolate Baileys mixture. I'm now going to turn the blender on. I know you could say that I could probably just buy a bottle of Baileys and it'll be cheaper than doing this, but you know what? Nothing beats making your own. together let's have a look Ooh. Ooh. and the good thing is if this tastes delicious I do have another can of condensed milk I suppose do you know how successful it is one has to have a little taste nutmeg on the top now. So a little nutmeg at the top. Now it's time to have a little taste. Mmm. Quite alcoholic. They nearly make my eyes pop out. Mmm. A bit just as delicious as I remembered it and Oh my goodness, this is way too good. And a huge thank you and cheers to Fabio and Isis for introducing me to this delicious drink. Oh, 
look at that. Wow. Hi. Excellent. Brinde. Yeah, yeah, cheers. Cindy from Brazil. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>